just need to. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's almost 6 a.m. and uh, probably another two hours before light. Pretty cooked. Oh, how's it going? Oh, oh good face, Josh. Yeah, you just uh, get a soft puffer. 2024. The top bit's really techy, which is quite difficult, considering I'm a roadie. Yeah. <laughs> and then the bottom bit's really like flowy, it's really nice. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Good, yeah, yourself? Good, man, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm so filthy anyway, like, where am I going to nap on the floor in the mud? So I do not normally drive an internal combustion engine car, and certainly not one as mental as this Range Rover that I've got. But Josh needs to go to this event, so we're driving on the, the A9 up towards Inverness, and we're gonna to go to Strath Heffer. Uh, but to get up there, to get all the kit, and to, to make sure we're kind of comfortable, so we have hired this car. It's from a company called Turo. So I last hired a Turo in America in 2015 when I actually got a Tesla. But here, they've been in the last couple of years, it's basically the Airbnb of car hire. It's Gorinda's personal Range Rover and obviously looking after it, so no, you know, it's a rental, so don't be gentle, none of that. You can look after the car. You've seen the weather forecast. Mm -hmm. The one day where it's above zero, we're gonna be racing. Minus eight next week, and today it's minus four, so we've got the perfect weather window. So we're going to Strathpeffer, but the event is Strathpuffer, or people call it the Puffer. And it's a 24 hour mountain bike event, going around a 12 kilometer circuit. Hey. Um, you head down this road, there's a marquee, uh, about 100 meters down, 200 meters, uh, and then they'll tell you then where to park. Oh, okay, okay. No cool, thank Have you. Really Just seeing people's making me like, think it's going to be a tough ask, but yeah. good night's sleep in a bed will give me an advantage already. So how are you feeling? Alright, slept well. Was up a bit during the night, but um, not too bad. Getting the, the fuel in for the morning, porridge. We're in Scotland. I just want to get started, I'm got pre-event pre nerves. I want to try and get a podium, that might be very ambitious, but I feel like it's better to be ambitious to start with and then reassess later in the race when I've been dropped. And um, At least start with that goal. And then we can work our way down. <laughs> it's just finishing. Yes, and um, why, is this, why this race? And what's so special about this race? I think it's meant to be one of the hardest 24 hour mountain bike events there is in the UK. It's like 17 hours of darkness, it's cold, we're up in top of Scotland almost, and it's just gonna be brutal. It's like a game of perseverance. But um, yeah, yeah, looking forward to it. Looking forward to the pain. Brand new six pack um, from Exposure. Massive bit of uh, metal here. Um, this hopefully will last all night, but um, it lasts for 36 hours on the lower setting. And um, it goes on the higher setting. It can last four hours, but that's super bright. So all up hills, I'll be putting it on the lower setting just to save battery life. And then downhills work on full brightness. So I've got, it's basically daylight in, at night. And then I'm going to take the Toro as like a backup, just a lightweight. And then I'll have a helmet light as well. Most ultras that I've done, I've always needed a rear light because you go on roads and things, but I'm pretty sure I don't need a rear light because we're just in the forest. Scottish jam. Getting my carb mix into my, into my bottle. So, I've got a full size XC mountain bike, giant anthem. And then I have my giant revolt that I've been using a lot this year, so my position's really dialed on that one. Always feels better when you're pedaling. Yeah. Get rid of the nerves that way. Try not to puke off the start line. 
<laughs> Charlie, Josh, what are we doing? We're in just outside of Compton. We're here for Strath Puffer. <laughs> Lots of big setups here. Um, we're in a small, relatively small setup, just the three of us. And we're going to be riding for 24 hours. Welcome to the 17th Puffer. Uh, I know our old friends, so can you keep a secret? No. So, Steve and Tracy are getting married today at the Puffer at 2 o'clock, but by Bill. But please, don't tell anybody. <laughs> so, if you pass it at 2 o'clock, give a cheer. Big cheer for Steve and Tracy. Yes. Well done, mate. Yes, mate. Well done, mate. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, Come on, the descent. <laughs> yeah, how did it go? Uh, it's a lot more technical than I was expecting. Oh, really? Oh. I can try and make some time up on the feed and just keep yeah. on going. You never know when people are going to stop, so. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah, man. Uh, see you in a bit. See you in a bit. Have a good one. Good luck. <laughs> Oh, good fight, Josh. Yeah, dude, just uh, the Strathpuffer 2024. Yeah. Out here with Josh. Uh, Did you win last two. year? No, I know. I came second last year. It was a uh, oh, okay. fun race against a uh, good friend, Robbie. Robbie yeah. Mitchell. He's nice. Is he here this year? Or? Yes, he, he is in pairs this year. Ah, okay. We'll see him in the course. Yeah. We've well, just done the two hours in on the third lap. And uh, yeah, just keep on pushing. Got to make use of the the uphill was a bit slower on the downhills. Okay. 
Hold that hill from here. Hmm. Now how I'm doing? The last time I looked you were... Yogurt. Six drops, yep. Yogurt's here. There's an apple here. Now we're on a banana. Yep. So you are six. Nice. And... You're not far away from the... What, the, the, the four and five. Yeah. And six. You're all close together. Yeah. Re relatively, about like top 15 five minutes. minutes. At the moment, top five is a pop. It's there. Yeah. Right, okay. Good luck. Can I have Red Bull next lap? What do you want? Red Bull next lap. Okay. There he is. Yes, Josh! Yes, mate! I'm <laughs> right through this bit, please. <laughs> <laughs> What's happened? Oh, uh, we're off on a bump. <laughs> oh. oh, man, I hope you're okay. Go, go, go. Cheers. I've lost track of the, the number of laps I've done, but I think I'm on lap five. Uh, just under four hours completed. So that means there's 20 to go. And uh, yeah, it's starting to feel like a grind going up this hill. to go. <laughs> What's been going on with you so far? I feel a bit sick right now. I was, I was like stuffing a, a wrap with peanut butter and jam in and then like all the way up the last climb. Got it down me but like coming down I was just like oh, no. <laughs> but oh, no. how's the riding going? Oh it's just really good. Yeah. So much fun like the, the top bit's really techy which is quite difficult considering I'm a roadie. Yeah. <laughs> and then the bottom is really like flowy, it's really nice. 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 But yeah, my, I think my hands are going to start to hurt by the end. Yeah, you're not wearing my gloves? With gloves. It's actually really warm, it? Yeah. kind of cooling me down a bit. Yeah. Damn roasting. <laughs> yeah, good fun, just yeah. keep, keep on plugging away. Yeah. I think last lap I was fifth place. Yeah, last, I think. I might have looked down a few places. I think last time I looked you were seventh. Okay. Which was about half an hour ago. Yeah. I have not looked since. Nice. That's pretty damn good though. Yeah. Yeah, happy with that? Yeah, just keep on going. Yeah. You never know when anyone else is going to stop, so you just got to race your own race. Yeah. It's kind of nice because you, you're going past people and you don't know where they are. Yeah. You don't have a clue where people are on the course. Everyone's just going to mix them together now. Yeah. How are we doing? How's your day been? I can be. That drone shot move must have been amazing. Yeah, man. <laughs> it was like two minutes. Sam from Exposure. All right. Nice to see a familiar face. Yeah. Takes the mind off spinning the pedals. They're yeah, all good fun and whacked on the lights because it might get dark by the end of this lap.
There you go, sandwich. Pasta. Well, it's all filled off Sorry? The yogurt. Oh, great. Mm. Oh, Pasta and yogurt. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's big. Okay, so you're still fifth, sixth. Can, some more, can you put some more apricots in there? Yeah. How's the feeling in the dark? Huh? Uh, it was amazing to start with. I've got yogurt all over my face. <laughs> Oh, y yogurt and mud. Tasty. It was really good to start with. It was like fresh, and it felt like a new ride. But then it's just started to drag on now. Yeah. But uh, just keep on plugging away. I think I've stopped for about ten minutes so far. I'm about what, ten hours in, I think. Yeah. Two more to halfway. Yeah, two more to halfway. All right. See you in a bit. See you in a bit. Oh. Can I have a salt in my next one? I'm doing it now. How's he doing, Colin? I think we're doing okay now that we've found Josh's salt. <laughs> and he's had a little, oh, look at that. So that is beautiful. That's pasta that we cooked yesterday or today. When did we cook that pasta? Last night. Yeah. And it's now got lovely, lovely strath pepper mud on it. Mm. And he's ingesting that. So he's getting extra proteins, no doubt, from that nice mud. Right, so. That's his next one that's got salt in. And I may as well do his next one as well after that. Yeah. I don't, he might want a, a Red Bull after that, mightn't he? Maybe for the extra kick. Or seven. <laughs> God, what can you see in there? <laughs> it's amazing. No, it's actually okay. It looks bad from the outside. <laughs> Plenty of water. Yeah. How about light? What place am I? You can just look at that, I'm fine with light. You're sixth. No, you're seventh now. Okay. But it's all very, very uh, nothing in it. Right. Second minute. You got this, mate. feeling now? Um, good, it's good to be past halfway. Not, um, hopefully I'll get easier and easier. This is going to be the hardest bit, I think. This next little bit. Two, three o'clock. Yeah. Tough one. The laps are taking me like an hour and a half now. Yeah. Whereas they were taking me under an hour before. Yeah.
How you doing? Wobbly. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> How's everything yeah, right feeling? <laughs> All right. Just need to. Oh, wait, wait. Keep, oh. On, keep on going. Um, one more lap, and well, half, half lap, and I think I'll be halfway. Be, yeah. I really need a spoon for this, rather than squeezing it out. <laughs> mm. It's nice when it goes down pretty easy. Yeah, yeah. Mm. What's keeping you going at the moment? Uh, I don't know. <sighs> it's getting harder and harder to do the techie section. Really? Just like tiredness. Yeah, is the course changing much with the with the? Well, you forget where bits are. I'll finish that Red Bull next lap. Is there somewhere so cool. you can put it? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Right, for sure. No worries, man. No worries. Oh, appreciate it. You got this. You got this. Woo, do you wanna sub in for me? Yeah, <laughs> I'd, I'd love to. Mate. I'd love to. Have a good one, man. Yeah. All the best. Do you want cheese and ham like you had the last I time? I can't get this on. Yeah, I just want some cheese and the cheese and ham. Okay. Yeah. Cheese and ham and bread though? No. Oh, is that in bread? Yeah. Okay. What about other food? I'll have some yogurt. Okay, get down to... I'll have to get your spoons in a minute. Oh, you're starting now, I'll get your spoons. I don't think I'll, I'll just... Yeah, you won't get out now. Eat, eat the bread though, Josh. Well, but I'll do it on the go. Okay. What about drink? I've already sorted it. Okay. Uh, I didn't know you were here. I was just getting some stuff under the car, so I didn't know. And um, there's some Red Bull under the car. Mm -hmm, I'll have some. Okay. Right. Uh, See you in two hours. Less than that, because you did very well. Oh. Eight hours till white. Yeah. yeah. How are you doing? I'm okay. I'm struggling quite a lot. But half expected. All right. See you okay. later. See you later. See you later, mate. You got this. The track even now. Uh, it's alright, there's definitely less people on it now. Really? People are in bed. <laughs> like it, I should be. Yeah. <laughs> How does it feel to still be going? Tough. I've done 15 hours now of riding. And then so I've, I've been stopped for 23 minutes now. I think I'm gonna stop at the car again, down some Red Bull. Have a bit of yogurt. That yogurt lasts a long time. Yeah. <laughs> is this snow or is this like it's kind of slushy snow, isn't it? It's falling now. Yeah, I don't think it's like proper snow. I think it's just the the, the rain's coming down, and just making everything just like weird. Uh, the course doesn't feel icy. No. No. So we're all good on that. Yeah. How do you feel temperature-wise? Uh, my hands are a bit cold when I left last time. I was like regretting not taking bigger gloves, and then I warmed up. I'm glad I put the coat on though. I think I needed that. And how are you feeling food wise? Um, I think I'm, I'm doing well fueling. Yeah. Little and often. Yeah. It's like just trying to get 
put anything down, but then it doesn't involve throwing it up. Yeah. I feel like if you eat too much, you just feel lethargic, so you can't really push anyway. Yeah. You've got, you've got to find balance between eating enough and not feeling sick. A very fine line between that. You ate the bread. Yeah. Right, some pasta here. Mm -hmm. No. Banana? Mm -hmm. No. Coat? Mm. I can't fit anything in here. What about baby bell? No, I'm not sure. What's going through your head most when you're riding up there? Um, sometimes I feel good and like I'm able to push, and then other times it's just like spinning. My head's pretty blanked at the minute, to be honest. Have I got water on my bike? No. I'll just take one off. And then you just put one on. Okay. Mm. Hey. Right. <sighs> Any final words? <laughs> uh, let's go. <laughs> 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 You got this, mate. Two hours before light. I'm uh, pretty cooked. It started to snow. I really want to stop, but uh, just keep on plugging away. Just take it easy and just keep the other legs spinning. Two more hours and then I can. Oh, four more hours and I can stop. Okay? Yeah. Can yeah. I have one of the sandwiches? You can, yeah. How's it going? Uh, but I can't toast it for you. Thanks. I feel so sick. Sick? Yeah. <sighs> Top 10, Josh. <laughs> Keep it up. How are you doing with lights? Um, I'm fine. Six, does that mean six hours? Yeah, but I don't. I only use it on low for going uphill. <laughs> uh, how about one of your? I can't get that on. Can you put that on? Yep. How about your loop chest, Josh? Can I pull that flap jack? I'm just gonna go. Oh, that flap jack is really on. nice. So yeah. just uh, chomp on that. It's, it's really soft. Yeah, it should be light by the next time I come around. Ish. Uh, what? It's four past six. It'll be eight o'clock ish. You alright, Josh? Yeah. Morning. Morning, how you doing? No bad, thank you much. Beautiful morning. Hi, good boy. How you doing? One more lap. Yeah, boy, you got this.
Oh. 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 You okay? <laughs> you good? I'm a white man. I got that on camera. Yeah. <laughs> that's what the that's the levels that Strap Buffer takes you to. Well done. Yeah. Hey, hey how's it going, buddy? Good man, yeah, yourself? Good man, yeah. Hell yeah. No yeah. Hey, James, you need to keep going. He started. What? He started. Keep on going, you'll catch him. <laughs> He's all about two minutes up the road. Three, two. two minutes. Now, in the second half of the last lap, uh, 10 minutes to 10, which should be 24 hours. We have till 11 to finish the loop. So, really excited to be done. It's been a long night. <laughs> What's going on in your head? How are you feeling? That was so much fun, the last little bit. <laughs> yeah? Just like, knowing that I was done. Yeah. But like, I was in pain on that last lap. Just my, my hands, I couldn't like, because all the bumps just like, sent like, pain too much. Uh, wrists. I can't speak properly, I've been awake for 25 hours. <laughs>